Hello, this is Sally from Launch Code, and today we're going to start learning about MVC controllers and a framework called ASP.NET Core MVC. ASP.NET Core MVC is part of .NET Core and is used to build web applications that follow the model view controller design pattern. During these videos, you should be coding along with us. This is a great way to get some practice and build some small applications. If at any point though, you want to go back and reference some old code or double check your solution against what we've been putting together, there is a GitHub repo linked in the textbook for you to check out that includes information for the start and end points for your, each video in this lesson. So be sure to check that out when you are studying and we will go ahead and talk about this application. Today, we're gonna build our first web application using the model view controller design pattern. We're gonna call it helloasp.net and I have it up and running here. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you a little bit about what it will look like once we are done with it. Before I do that, just so you know, my application runs at server port number 5001. If yours does not for any reason, that is totally fine. When I navigate to 5001, you navigate to whatever port number works for you. So let's go ahead and check out a few of the different routes that we will be working with today. Here's our first one slash hello world slash welcome. Welcome to my app world. Now we'll be learning a little bit about how we can add query strings here. So name equals Tilly. Welcome to my app Tilly. We will be learning about something new for us called a path variable. So here we are with slash Tilly. Welcome to my app Tilly. And the final route we will be working with will be building a form slash hello world, let me fill out the form. As you can see, we're gonna use Tilly. I hit greet me, welcome to my app Tilly. All right, so that is the application we will be building today. So let's go ahead and get started.